Do you feel that, Cerebrit? The Protoss are here, on Char. They have been for some time, hiding. Protoss Commander, it was folly of you to come here, for I am Kerrigan, and I am Queen of the Zerg. I know of you well, O oh Queen of the Zerg, for we have met before. I am Tassadar of the Templar. I remember your selfless exploits, defending humanity from the Zerg. Unfortunate it is to see that one who was once so honorable and full of life would succumb to the twisted wiles of the Overmind. Do not presume to judge me, Templar. You'll find my powers to be more than a match for yours. In fact, I sense that your vaunted power has diminished since last we met. Mayhap, O oh Queen. Or is it only that I need not flaunt my power in such an infantile test of will? Foolish Templar, prepare your defenses. I will come for you soon. Insufferable Protoss coward. Tassadar cannot evade my wrath forever. I shall find him and cut it. Kerrigan, Zas is dead. Oh? It is a pity that Cerebrates cannot truly be killed. I expect that the Overmind will reincarnate him soon. No, he will not. The Protoss have devised some new attack, an attack powerful enough to nullify our reincarnation and give pause to the Overmind itself. So, Tassadar's plan was merely a diversion. I should not have underestimated him so. Without its master, Zas's brood has run amok and even now threatens the Hive Cluster. Cerebrate, you must eradicate the rampaging brood and stem any further damage it might cause. I shall deal with the Protoss myself. Behold, my long silence is now broken, and I am made whole once more. The cunning Protoss have dared strike down that which was immortal. For the Protoss who murdered Zaz are unlike anything we have faced before. These Dark Templar radiate energies that are much like my own. And it is by these energies that they have caused me harm. Yet shall their overweening pride be their downfall. For when the assassin Zeratul murdered Zaz, his mind touched with mine, and all his secrets were made known to me. I have taken from his mind the secret location of Ayr, the Protoss homeworld. At long last, my children, our searching is done. Soon we shall assault Ayr directly. For now, we must ensure that the Dark Templar can cause no more harm. Cerebrate, you shall set a trap for our foes. Kerrigan will lead them to you. My children, the hour of our victory is at hand, for upon this world of Ayr shall we incorporate the strongest known species into our fold. Then shall we be the greatest of creation's children. We shall be... perfect. Yet before I can be made manifest upon this world, the way must be prepared. 
You must seize the Kidaran Crystals, for within them lies power undreamed of by the Kotas. Go now, my Cerebrit. Secure the Crystals and bring swift wrath to all who oppose the Swarm. You have done well, my Cerebrit. The Protoss can do nothing but flee before the onslaught of the Swarm. But now you must assault one final sight before our conquest is assured. Behold, there is a temple not far from here that lies upon ground most hallowed. Though I have borne witness to the passing of countless millennia, the temple which you must assault is older by far. For it was constructed by my creators, the Zelnaga, and it marks the site where the Zelnaga first set foot upon Ire. The temple must be cleared, and the Kaderan crystal set in its place. Only then shall the way be made ready, for it is upon that ground alone that I may be manifest.